Good morning, Gravelers. It's an exciting day here in Peach and Vermont. The sun is out, fall is in the air, the foliage is coming, and I'm about to take a shot of Wahoo Espresso. I'm gonna go get ready to crush the Peach and Fall Fondo. Actually, I'm not gonna crush it. I'm gonna ride slow and eat some pie. see so many people come to our small town. We do have the silent auction going, which will be open until three o'clock. All the proceeds of that go to the Mariah Wilson Foundation, which is great. And also the Wilsons are here riding today. So, yeah, that's just remember, remember to ride today, let's keep it safe. And we're gonna follow Jeff in the uh, old fire engine. We're gonna enjoy food and drinks, pie and cider um, afterwards. Yes, and thank you to our pie bakers. A lot of you brought pies as well, so I think maybe we need to start doing like a pie competition. Um, and it's, it's totally okay if you do the first half of the loop and you decide that's enough. I've done this event all four years and I've never finished, so no shame on you if you don't finish the event. All right, everyone, thank you again for coming out. Let's have a great ride and uh, right on time. We'll meet back here in a few hours. How you doing back there? Oh, I like your number. That's awesome. I'm the number. You're the biggest number? Yeah. 221? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. That's super cool. Have fun. Thank you. What is your favorite part of the Peach and Fall Fondo? Ooh. Uh, I mean, as the organizer, having it all done, everyone back safe. As a rider, this is a new road. We haven't ever done this before. This is uh, County Road. We do have a gnome coming up here. So I'm, so I'm drifting back just to make sure that it's visible. Okay. Um, yeah. This, I like mix. I like mixing up. I, mean, I also just love seeing so many riders on these roads that I ride all the time by myself. Right. <laughs> yeah. It's an unreal crowd. It is. Yeah, it's a good good mix of people who want to ride fast, who want to cruise, who never done an event before. That's I guess the goal of it is like opening it up to all people who want to come to Peachum and ride bikes. Absolutely. Yeah. Awesome. Thank Great, you. Man. Have a yeah. good day. We'll Enjoy see it. you at the pie stop. I'll see you there.
So we are about seven miles in. We've climbed just over a thousand feet. And this has to be like the most beautiful weather I've ever ridden in. It's crisp and cool. The foliage is popping. Everybody's happy to be riding bikes. And we know there's pie coming at some point. So it's going to be a great day. Just hit the first rest area. We're in Raggate. As always, we find ourselves somewhere along Bailey Hazen Road, where we love to have fun. Bailey Hazen Road. Bailey Hazen Road. We're on the Bailey Hazen Road. This is quintessential Vermont. Look right here. Look at that. You got some early foliage. You got some farm fields, some people on bikes on dirt roads. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Apples all over the place. Wild Branch Cider could have made us something nice out of that, I bet. Road apples. Cedar, can you make things out of road apples? Just over 20 miles, about five miles away from Pi. Climbed about 2,800 feet. So that's like 10 pieces of pie, I think. Point being, I've earned my pie. Couple miles away from Pi. Check that out.
Elkins Tavern. It's a monument to the Bailey Hazen. We are in Peachin. Where there is pie. And it appears to be exactly noon. The church is playing music. Picturesque downtown Peachin. Get all that delicious food. It all looks delicious. Don't forget the whipped cream. Yeah, no, that's a bit. Ice cream Ice cream around the corner. Oh, whoa. Check that out. Maple. You scooping maple? Yeah. Maple? That's amazing. Like everything so far away. That's true. Yeah. yeah. From here. Oh, you live here in Peachum? Yeah. Yeah. What percentage of people don't go beyond so this pie stop? I'd put it at like 100. Yeah, just for the smart. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you so much. All right. I'll wait. You get a little bit of vanilla mixed in. I'm in a huge rush today. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's pie time. This is an incredibly robust sport. Look at this. Mmm, maple ice cream on apple pie. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's super good. So good. Aid station ever. So that was the pie stop. I am actually feeling pretty full of maple ice cream and apple pie. But that was like one of the best experiences you can have at an aid station, I think. So super delicious. Now we hit the back half of the ride, or a little under half, I guess. It's still amazing. Joe's Brook. This is my old pre Strava days stomping ground. It's so nice. 4,500 feet of climbing so far. Now we're gonna turn.
Sure. Billy beans. That's the best. It was like I was with the. Not every aid station has billy beans. Tiger. So good. Mm -hmm. That was exactly what I needed. Billy beans fix everything. And we gotta finish. There's a little bit of climbing left. the beautiful day in Peach. If you like what you saw, like and subscribe. See you next time, Gravelers. So I was told don't come home without a pie. Okay. Well, I can help you with that. I need a pie. Apple. Or what What? What do you recommend? Well, we What's got... the best? Uh, we have a few complete apples. Yeah. We have some partial apples. And we have a half of a pumpkin. And then I'll, we have a flourless chocolate tort. I'll take a full apple. Is that a full apple? That's a full apple. I'll take a full apple. Okay. May I? You may. Thank you. Look at that. Awesome. I'm going to take it just like this. All right then. There you are. Look at that. Easy piece. I got a pie. Pie. Thank you Thank so you. much. All right. So I got my precious cargo. Got my pie to go home. There aren't many grinders where you can finish, buy a whole pie, bring it home, and in theory, I'm not gonna eat the whole thing before I share it with the family, but you know, things happen. Just wanted to give a quick shout out to Chase from Tennessee. I met him in the parking lot because uh, he was riding a checkpoint. Wanted to ask him about it. So it was a rental, turns out Chase is from Tennessee. Turns out Chase has a really compelling story. Was watching lots of YouTube videos and then saw our video of the Ranger 2021, when Ian Boswell assisted Steve in his moment of despair. Thanks. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're good. <laughs> all out there. That's all. He's fine. Do you need 50 bars? <laughs> oh, yes, please. Emailed Boz. Boz, of course, being the awesome person he is, said, hey, you make it up here. We'll get you in the ride. So uh, it was super cool to meet Chase, hear his story, and uh, know that he's now on vacation in Vermont to ride the Peach and Fall Fondo. Chase, if you're out there, pleasure meeting you. Hope the rest of your trip goes well. And we'll see you all next time, Gravelers. I got some pie to go eat.